you already know we got some new edit styles for Caster and Elmira. Show you them real quick now. The actual edit style when you go into it is not the correct photos or the correct name. That's like a Save the World character <laughs> over there on the left, which is kind of busted right now. So I'm not really sure what they're calling this edit style. But um, it's got to be something with lava or fire or some kind of spells. Their backlings as well have edit style. So this is, here we go, the Spellbinder. Again, the icons are messed up on this as well. It looks like they just dipped this thing in tar and then put a feather on it. <laughs> it's just completely blacked out. Murdered out backbling for sure. And then Elmira's um, tomb pouch, tomb pouch, has a lot more going on in terms of it's not just dipped in black and then put some feathers on it. So I, I think this one looks cool, but I think this one, I don't know. I think people are, are gonna like this. It's it's a completely black back bling with a little orange feather. So as per usual, we're gonna get some gameplay with these new skins and then back blings for both of them and skins with both back blings. So with that being said, let's get sweaty. So we're using the heat weapon wrap. I know we could have used like the animated lava one, but I'm not really a fan of it. It's just a lot going on. And this one just seems cleaner to me. It's got like the orange, the bright orange accents. I like that his hands are on fire. You can see it while we're ADSing there. Yeah, the heat weapon wrap looks great because there's not a lot of orange on the outfits anyways. So I think the weapon wrap goes fine. They look pretty clean. The back bling is just completely murdered out, though. It's insanely dark. It's nuts. What are you, 90s? So I was trying Borderlands 3 yesterday, guys. Not sure if I'm going to keep playing. I think I'm playing with a guy named Zane. I'm not sure. People tell me that he's, like, the worst guy to play. I'm like, oh, great. I just wasted three hours playing on Zane, trying to, trying to learn about the game. But, um... I'm interested to find some back blings from my man here. We got a fair amount of black and orange we can use. I would say fair. We don't have like a ton that'll match like this whole lava theme. But we do have some black back blings and then we can do like some oranges. So it should be interesting uh, to find out what matches my man here. So we have a decent number of back blings for caster here. Now a lot of blacks. Um, we got like all of the bright oranges I believe to my knowledge here. Now it is like 5 in the morning, so <laughs> uh, I'm still trying to wake up after going to the gym. This one's a stretch. Uh, not, I just, I thought it kind of looked interesting. Retribution with the orange edit style looks good. The other ones, maybe the red. Uh, no, the orange looked the best. Padlock is one of my favorites. Actually, in-game as well. It's very simple. The Molten Valkyrie Wings, and it was coming. Not a surprise there. The Molten Crested Cape. The gold coin, it's okay. Gauge shows your number of elims. This always displays 90 for me, obviously. Spider Shield. Wolf Pack. Dark Pack. Ah, this one's a total stretch. I thought maybe we could blend some purple with the orange. I mean, unless you have a purple harvesting tool, probably not. Goody Gourd. Laser Wings. Night Cloak. Again, kind of a stretch. Barrel and Booty with like the little red uh, map. I don't know. It's uh, This one's kind of weird as well. Kind of interesting though. Banner shield, very hard to find an orange to go with these very bright, vibrant oranges. I tried yellows, I tried reds, I tried grays. I'll show you that after this. This is the tone pouch, tomb pouch, tomb pouch, tone pouch. New edit style, stripe stalker. This is the dipped in tar spellbinder now. <laughs> Prospect looks okay. The white, not a chance. Rift rock, signal hub, spike satchel. Ah, again. I just thought you guys might have thought you wanted to see that on there. So I tried it out and it, I'm really not feeling it. And now that I'm looking at it, I think we could stretch a couple of brown back blings here too for his pants. J Sport back bling. So, real quick, um, right off the back, buckled. It's going to look really good with his pants. Um, what else do we have that's brown? Maybe that's a stretch. What else do we else have brown? Uh, Eh, not really. This is okay. That's orange. I missed that one. This will look pretty good. Road ready. It's okay with the pants. Browns. This one probably not so. Ooh, this should look good. Grande pack. It's okay. Again, I'm just focusing on the pants here. This is usually what I do when I'm looking for back things. I'll just go to one and I'll favorite it and I'll favorite it and I'll favorite it and I'll be like, oh yeah, that'll look good. That'll look good. It looks okay. 
a little too bright on the tans there. Maybe? Oh, that's interesting. So keep in mind, you can do some browns here. That blue's ruining it for me. If it was like an orange inside, that'd be really cool. Uh, stretching. That's okay. So back to the banner shield. I wanted to show you guys the colors I tried with gray. Gray is... Nah. I tried a red as well. Eh. I tried a bright yellow to try to like go with the like I don't know the accents of the fire on him. Not really can't can't really walk it in there at all. We don't have a brown either, so I I mean if I had to wear a color, I'd probably just wear orange. Like this darker orange. But even then, it just really doesn't look that great on him. I'm gonna be honest with you guys it might have been easier to show you what it's not gonna match with because it's an all black literally murdered out back bling with a little orange feather now the orange feather really doesn't throw me off in terms of combos but it does really complement certain ones like when we get to the german mogul master and alpine ace it looks really good this looks great looks really good on these two obviously looks great on him black widow Dark Red Knight. The Orange Feather doesn't really ruin it for me, like I said. The Reaper. Ruin? Now, it, it is... Okay, it's almost too dark for some outfits. It almost it almost, it almost looks just too dark for some of these. Look, Star. Elmira in the house. Iconic. The new default. Mogul Master Canada looks good. This is my favorite. Mogul Master Germany. It looks really good. That feather just complements the entire outfit as well. Very cool. Perfect shadow. Spooky team leader. Gold trooper, because I knew someone was going to ask. Looks it doesn't look good at all. It's too dark. Looks great on Shadowbird. Like, these ones look really good. That looks great. Let me talk to your manager. She does have the white edit style, but uh, it's okay. It's okay. Red line. Cypher. Circuit Breaker. Survival Specialist. Aura. Looks really cool on her. Renegade. And the Whistle Warrior. So like I said, there's there's so much more you could use with this back bling. But my favorite has got to be Germany. On the end of style. Really cool. Elmira has always been like an interesting skin to me. I've always liked her default style. And not, not a huge fan of Caster's. But I love Caster's new edit style. So, Caster's new edit style, I think I like more than Elmira's. But I like Elmira's default more than Caster's default. Does that make sense? And, again, we're using the Heat Weapon Wrap. And uh, just looking at looking at her back bling, yes, there's more color. So, it's not going to be as flexible with the back bling combination. So, keep that in mind because it is not murdered out like Caster's was. Sweaty 90s. So, getting used to the sensitivity I'm using. We'll get there, guys. Regardless, um, it, it still looks really good, man. I just think I like her default more. Caster, I love his new edit style more. It's kind of weird how like I flip-flop between the two like that. So we have roughly the same backlinks here for Elmira that we use for Caster. Not a lot has changed in terms of what's going to match. Gage, looks okay. Fire Shield, not bad. Retribution, orange edit style looks the best. Padlock, my favorite. Molten Valkyrie Wings, 10 out of 10. Molten Crested Cape, I like more. It's not as bulky and like in your face. Gold Token looks good. Wolfpack looks juice. Goody Gourd, not bad at all. Laser Wings, pretty cool, pretty cool. Not, uh, see, this one's okay. It's uh, not really feeling it though. Spellbinder, Murdered Out Spellbinder. Stripe Stalker. Tana looks great. Sunwings, nice and vibrant. Signal Hub, Rift Rock. The Banner Shield again, like I said, the colors are tough. The colors are tough. Tone Pouch, Toxic Kitty, and the Vintage AKA Jansport Back Bling. The Molten Battlehound with Elmira's Back Bling. Now, hers was a lot more unforgiving in terms of finding what matches. <laughs> so, um, some different outfits here the Raptor. This looks okay. Velocity. I like it on both of them. Vertex. This one's just kind of... It really doesn't make sense, but it's kind of cool. 
Ember? When's the last time you saw her? She's nice. Obviously, it came with Elmira. Hookstar again. Caster, he knew it was coming. Duh. Beef boss, kind of a stretch here. China looks really good to me. I like that. So the burnt edit styles for both of the gingers are really cool. Non-burnt and burnt. I like the burnt. Jack Gordon. Blech. Again, burnt Marine Marauder here. And not burnt. Those are my favorites so far. I also like the Germany again, dude. It looks really good. This one's interesting. Mm, on the fence on that one. Explode. Sunbird. Looks okay. She does have the edit style to take off her mask. It's okay, though. Winnegade Weta. It's all right. It's, it's not really the right orange, but it's okay. Mayhem. I like this. This looks pretty cool to me. Guaco. It's interesting. We're stretching. Straw Ops. Not bad. Spooky Team Leader. It's okay with the oranges. I can see it. Aura looks juicy. I like that. Bunny Moon doesn't look bad either. Jungle Scout. Okay, this is probably my favorite now that I got to it again. And Tracker. So my favorite is Jungle Scout for sure. Looks really good. And with that being said, guys, liking the video is always appreciated. Subscribing is free. If you would like to be in the Fortnite item shop, that is P-I-Z-0, pizza with a zero. And we'll see you nerds on the live stream. See ya!